In my previous video, there was an interesting comment about buying a 5-star Lycone from the Starlight Exchange Shop. At first I thought, well that seems unrealistic, it would take way too long. But is it really? Today we will be talking about if it's worth it for an F2P to buy a 5-star Lycone from the Starlight Shop, this one right here. As you can see, it costs 600 Undying Starlight to make the purchase, which you can obtain by pulling duplicates of characters or light cones above 4 star, 8 for 4 star, and 40 for 5 stars. Hold on a sec, um, there we go. Okay, so I have calculated how many pulls it would take to get 600 Undying Starlight. Please be aware that these are very rough calculations with a lot of assumptions, because if there's one thing that we can predict, it's luck. And in these calculations, I am only factoring in the average bad luck scenarios people can have in their polls. Now how many polls would people need to reach soft pity and get a 5 star in a banner? Well, in a bad luck scenario, uh, generally 80 polls. So we go 8 times 8, 64 starlight. Let's put in the 5 star starlight as well, which is 40, because we don't know if along those 80 polls, people got more than 8 4 stars. And if people pull on the character banner and get a new character, say a new 5 star, the new character doesn't give you starlight, so we'll add 40 for good measure. So that's 104 starlight out of 600. So we do that 5 more times, which is 80 times 5, which is 400 pulls which is equal to 520 plus 104. That means 624 starlight. Okay, so that's 24 too many. So would we take away 30 poles, which is worth 24 starlight. Meaning it would take an average of 450 poles to buy one 5 star standard banner light cone, which will take months. And so far in the first week, the player who has completed everything only got about 300 free polls, factoring in everything that we got from pre-registration rewards to achievements, which means we are still 150 polls short. And as an F2P, you get 60 jades from dailies, 150 times 160 means that you require 24k jades for 150 polls. 24k uh, divided by 60 daily jades means that you need to get 400 days of daily jades to get 150 pulls. More than a year. Well, of course, in that time span, they would give out more jades and free pulls from events and new content, so it wouldn't take that long. But it would still take quite a few months. This is our one, by the way, for a free stick, which you can get refinement. Okay, calm down, buddy. So, is it worth it to buy these light cones as an F2P? I would say not, because it takes way too long. And by this time frame, you would already have Max Super impose every 5 star light cone on Herda Shop anyway, even though they're not as good as these gacha light cones. Heck, I would even say just straight up pull in a light cone banner with the amounts of pull you have if you really want a powerful gacha light cone. But at the end of the day, it really is up to you. If you have the patience to wait that long, go for it. Play the game in the way that's most comfortable to you. That's all I want to talk about today. If you enjoyed or found this video helpful, leave a like, comment, and subscribe. It's free and it helps me out a lot. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.